It is no secret that most television and film actors are 100% dedicated to their roles. Often, that dedication extends into not just becoming the character on the inside, but also in becoming the character on the outside. Some of the more demanding roles even require actors to look nothing like themselves, meaning that they must spend hours upon hours in the makeup chair to get their characters to the perfect look. I have tried to keep this list fresh as well as have given the spot to the deserving. So without further ado, let's dive in. This is a humble request to all the viewers. I would really appreciate if you could subscribe to my channel and help me motivate it to bring more interesting list for you guys. Tom Cruise in Tropic Thunder One of the funniest examples of an actor playing against his type came in Ben Stiller's 2008 comedy, Tropic Thunder. Stiller chose to cast action megastar Tom Cruise as an overweight, obnoxious, painfully uncool studio executive, paired with an always hilarious Bill Hader. Cruise nearly steals the movie as the hip-hop dancing, sailor mouth studio bigwig. The performance and makeup effects were so successful, a lot of the audiences for Tropic Thunder didn't even realize it was Tom Cruise who was grinding to Florida in front of them. Oscar Isaac in X-Men Apocalypse According to the actor, it was not easy for him to bring this mutant villain on the screen. The 39-year-old actor said that prosthetics used to transform him into the tutelar villain made him sweat so badly that it poured right into his ears. During the filming of X-Men Apocalypse, the actor tried his best not to freak out over this. Even though he was barely recognizable under all the makeup, the actor said it was rough for him whenever he transformed into the character. Moreover, even producer Simon Kingbird has turned the prosthetics into a nightmare it was also very uncomfortable. Oscar constantly was very hot, so he had cold water piped in through tubes. Whenever we were done shooting a sequence, we would have someone with a tank full of cold water that we would plug him into. Bill Skarsgård in It As portrayed by the actor in the movie It, Pennywise is a rather terrifying sight. Clowns are rather creepy under normal circumstances, but there is an extra bit of fear that comes packaged with knowing that he loves mutilating and eating children. Obviously, he is just a character in a movie, and not really an interdimensional, shape-shifting manifestation of evil, but he did still successfully manage to give some of his fellow actors the creeps. While explaining how he came up with that signature smirk for Pennywise, Scargard cracked the sinister smile for the cameras. You can only laugh to keep from crying. Bonnie Irons in The Conjuring 2 and The Nun First, she petrified you in The Conjuring 2 and now the second most famous nun after Mother Teresa is back for another round of terror. And this time, she is getting her own backstory. Who is playing the demonic nun in the upcoming horror film, The Nun? You ask, well, for starters, the actor is the same one who originated the role in The Conjuring 2, but that's definitely not the only place you have seen character actor Bonnie Irons before. Long before she brought the demon nun to life, she has done other makeup heavy projects. Johnny Depp, almost everything he has done. It is hard to pin down what Johnny Depp really looks like. The handsome actor has undergone astonishing transformations for his movie roles, from Willy Wonka to Captain Jack Sparrow. It is difficult to talk about every makeup oriented roles Depp has done. So here are most eccentric looks from him. And I'm pretty sure now he's used to sit in chair for hours for these prosthetics and makeup. Thank you for watching this video. If you know any other actors who have done similar projects, then please let me know in the comment section. If you like this list, maybe you will like my other works also. See you guys in the next list. Till then, have a good one.